Hey, all right, folks. It's the uh, next day, and a hundred percent chance of rain today. Calling for rain all day today, and uh, I couldn't help myself. I had to come back, and um, deep in the woods in this thicket, fighting the briars and the deadfalls, and I got a real decent signal, like a 12:44, and got this out of the ground. It looks like it's too big to be a half cent. It's heavy copper. And it looks like uh, a small bust on it, like one I'm not familiar with. I can barely see it. Uh, I don't expect to get a whole lot today. I kind of covered everything, and then uh, without uh, using a different detector, I might come back with my Desora when it's not supposed to be raining. But I got my CTX because it's waterproof, and uh, I don't know. I covered a lot of ground yesterday and uh, didn't really get into any hot areas. There's one area that's full of iron I'll have to hit with the soil, but uh, or maybe even dig some test holes and see what I come up with. But keeping on with the family history, bam! J Doug signing off. All right, folks. Uh, just about five minutes ago, I dug that coin over there by that tree. And now right here. I came up with this thing. It has two prongs on the back that I guess like a you would put in and spread out. It might have some writing on the back. I don't know. But it's kind of interesting. I've never seen it before. Don't know if it's a button or what in the world that is. But we'll clean it up. Put it in the pouch. Check it out later. J Doug signing off. Here's a little luck charm I just dug up out of the dirt, hibernating for the winter. Nice pretty blue tail. I'll put him back in the hole. Hopefully he'll figure it out <laughs> when I get done. See if I get a target out of here. I'm getting a, like a low reading, like aluminum or something like that. So it might just be trash, but cool little find. No lizard. J Ducks, I don't know. Hey folks. Uh, I guess it's been about a half hour, maybe 40 minutes since I got another target. But I worked my way that way along the edge there. And then I'm coming back this way. And I just hit this. I don't know if it's another token. But it has the numbers 924 in the center of it. And I can't read any more writing. It's about the size of a penny. I don't know what that would be. But, I don't know. Huh, hard to make out. Anyway, pretty sure it says 924. It's hard to make out with the cell phone. Anyway, that's my third find of the day. Just some junk so far, other, besides those other two targets and some coal that giving me a low reading. But, digging everything. J Ducks, I don't know. Alright, folks, well, I guess it's been about a, I don't know, 45 minutes, an hour, and uh, I went back to uh, where I found the ring yesterday that apparently didn't get recorded, and uh, close to where the token was, found that other coin close to there, and then just kind of, kind of middle, milling around, trying to figure out where I haven't been it's so confusing deadfalls everywhere everything looks the same I mean, try to grid it it's impossible but I just found this this heart shaped I guess it might be a rosette but it's got a lead back and three hooks semi intact but that's pretty cool I don't know how I missed that but you know can't always get it all <laughs> Digging it. J Doug signing up. Hey folks. Well, I guess it's been about a half hour and um deep in this thicket. This was underneath some brush right here and really kinda right on top of the ground. But uh I got another coin. It's kind of uh trying to get it so you can see it. It's got a bust on the front of it. 
you can't really make out what it is but you can see his nose in the bottom of the bus there Pretty heavy. It came out as a 24 or 1242 on the CTX VDI reading. I'll clean that up later and we'll see what we got. That's pretty cool. Nice solid reading. It was in the thick stuff. <laughs> Up underneath this brush, I had a clear spot out to get to it, but it gave a good signal. There's probably some deep stuff underneath of this brush that I'll never get to in these deadfalls. Uh, I'm going to get what I can. j Doug, signing off. Alright folks, well, I came back out here along this creek bed. I, I had to get out of that thicket for a while. It was wearing me out. And uh, I went up the edge of it the other day and I just came off of it a little bit and I got something here. A little star on it. It appears to be lead, although it's got like a white patina underneath that dirt. It's heavy. I don't know. Pretty cool. All right. Well, I'm gonna keep on keeping on. J Doug signing out. Hey folks. Uh, I guess it's been an hour or more since I found anything worth notable. There, I found a couple targets. I don't really know what they are. I'll add them to the end of the video or whatever but I just found another uh, big disc that's lead filled in the back this one looks like it might have had something in the center of it no hooks whatsoever but a good solid piece just down there um, almost the length of that pin pointer which any metal detector should pick that chunk up anyway you know what I mean but uh, just working my way back and forth I was going from left to right before and now I'm going this way and I seem to be hitting a few more targets just changing it up and so this is one of the more open areas but you know that's where I'm headed <laughs> but uh it's just difficult to figure out where you haven't been you know you just kind of try to get every nook and cranny that you can and uh cover all your bases there it is J Doug sign and all. Hey folks, uh, it, it had I didn't go two steps and found this uh, thimble. Pretty cool. I mean, right behind me, is that hole. And then there, that hole. <laughs> so that's pretty cool. Just uh, changing my angle of uh, attack, going from a different direction, seems to be working. Cause I know I covered this big open area tomorrow, yesterday, but it is what it is. There's the results. J Doug sounded. Hey folks. Uh been about five minutes and I got this thing. Pretty cool. I thought it was a fired bullet with rifle in order at first, but it's got this thing in it. Little pin. I don't know. That's cool though. J Doug sounding off. Hey folks, it's been about ten minutes and I just got a Indian head penny. Barely make anything out on there. Can't see any date. Well, we'll try to clean it up later. And see what it is. Right there. Just working my way back and forth. Seems to be a hot area. Right over there. I dug up that brooch. Right in front of that. Can't remember what that was. And then that weird looking thing that looked like it had the rifle on it. And then turned around and came back and got another target. So keep on keeping at it. G Doug signing off. Hey, bro, folks. Uh, it's been about 20 minutes, um, and I've checked every one of these fallen over trees, these deadfalls, these dirt mounds I put up, and haven't found one thing until now. And it's probably going to be another Indian head. It's pretty small. But I'll clean that up later and see what we got. The coins are adding up, and the flat buttons are. Slim. I don't quite understand that. Unless I'm near the store, it seems like I should be finding more about them tokens, but they don't give off a very good signal. Metal's cheap. But I keep on keeping on. J Doug signing off. Hey, folks. Um, I guess it's been about 15 minutes and uh, just got another ring. 
No stone this time. It's cool. Hopefully I get this one on video. The last one somehow I must have pushed the wrong button and it didn't take, but it's cool fine. Just working my way, getting into the thick stuff again and uh, trying to do what I can. Haha, J Dog, so I don't know. Alright folks, been about uh, ten or fifteen minutes and I just pulled this little buckle out of the ground right there. Trying to get underneath of this stuff and uh, pulled out a little teeny buckle. That's cool. J Dog, signing off. Hey folks, good news. I just got another one of my great great grandfather's store tokens. Exactly like the last one. Can't see anything on the back, but you can definitely see the number one and WPD across the top. Same shape, same size, everything. Too cool. It's getting pretty late in the day. Um, I'll probably get out of here pretty soon. Start heading back towards the truck. Maybe I'll find something awesome. That is cool. J-Dog signing off.